Hey YouTube, this is Blake with Blake's Game Room, and wow, I just got an excellent haul today from uh, GameStop, and um, if you guys don't know it, I think all of this week through Easter, it, it, on their PS2, GameCube, and Game Boy Advance games, is buy two, get two free. So, I got a pretty good little haul here. For $33, I got 21 games. So... Definitely, I got a good deal. I got this whole bag here of games for uh, for thirty-three dollars. So let me get some of these out here, and we'll go through them. Now, a lot of them, um, well, not a lot of them. Some of them were some sports games that were like ninety-nine cents, but um, for that price, you know, I could buy four sports games and get two free. Or buy two and get two free, so I got like four games for two dollars. So that was an excellent deal. Um, let's go ahead and start with those games. Um, so these are all like black box games, you know, like this. And uh, let's see what I got here. Uh, we've got for the PlayStation 2, NCAA March Madness 2005. NCAA March Madness 2002. We've got Koro Q or Korok from Atlas. That one was only 99 cents, so I picked that up definitely. We've got National Hockey Night from ESPN. This one looks pretty good from Taito, just based on the cover. Um, this is Ujingai, the Sacred City. So that one looked a little bit interesting. Uh, next up, we've got a contemplation disc, or compilation disc of Taito Legends. I think I have this one, or this one. Because I also got... Taito Legends 2. So I think I have one of these. If I do, I'll just take it back and get another game. Um, next up, we've got Pirate Legend of the Black Buccaneer. That one sounded kind of interesting. And we got NFL Head Coach. Next up, we've got. NCAA March Madness 2004. Next up, we've got Major League Baseball 2K5. And the last PS2 game is to go along with those NBA games I got the other week. It's NBA Live 2005. Um, I got one 360 game, and that's because it was only like $4.99. And uh, this is Lost Planet, the Extreme Condition. It is complete. And I was looking through another game, and I found this right here. So I grabbed it and uh, put it back in, you know, side this one like that, so you can't see it. So I thought that was pretty good. And the disc on this one is very, very clean. So I heard this was a really good game. It's made by Capcom. And um, it looks really good. I know number two just came out not too long ago. So I decided to give number one a shot. And next up I got uh, five GameCube games. And uh, let's go through these. I got some pretty good ones here. Uh, for $3.99... We got Wave Race Blue Storm. And this one is disc only, but this one's in really, really nice shape. Um, looks almost brand new. It just doesn't have the manual. Um, but Wave Race, definitely a pretty good little racing game. Uh, to keep the uh, water action going, we've got Kelly Slater's Pro Surfer. And this one is complete. I've never really seen a surfing game before, so I decided to pick that one up. Uh, we've got 007, Everything or Nothing, and this is disc and box only. 
box is in really bad shape. Oh yeah. Look at the uh, that water damage there. So definitely not a good shaped game, but um oh well. It was free. Uh, next up we've got Shonen Jumps uh, One Piece Grand Battle for the GameCube. It is complete. It even comes with the card. So really glad to get that. I've been wanting to get this game for a really long time now. Finally got to pick that up. And next up, I actually got two games in this one, and it was only $4.99. Um, I know Outlaw Golf is pretty good, but I didn't really know about this other game. But uh, this is Outlaw Golf and Darkened Sky. And as you can see, it's one, two, and it has both manuals in it. So there's the Outlaw Golf and the Darkened Sky manual. So I thought that was a pretty good deal for $4.99. I get two games. And, um,. They definitely look to be pretty good, so definitely not a bad price there. So technically, you can say I got 22 games. And last up, I did get, I did manage to pick up three Game Boy Advance games. We've got the Konami Collector Series Arcade, uh, Arcade Advance. So I thought that was a little compilation game. Um, we got Activision Anthology. And I saw this one, I decided to pick it up, and it is Wario Land 4. Um, they did have Final Fantasy 6, which I should have picked up, but I kind of forgot. Um, but they had all kinds of games, you know, I got all these games for like 33 bucks. And on the way home, me and my buddy, we decided to go chill at our favorite place, and that's uh, Level 8 Video Games. You guys hear me talk about them all the time. Um, and I just wanted to mention, I don't know if this is a rare game or whatever, but uh, in one of those case inserts um, was actually this. And I thought this was a pretty rare, you know, this black box. I thought this was pretty rare because um, it's a working designs game. And this is Sylphie the Lost Planet. This is the insert and the manual. So I thought those were pretty rare, so I kept those. I gave all the other inserts and all to uh, that local game store. Um, I thought they might be able to use them if they get the games in or whatever. And the last stuff I got here is uh, I got three Dreamcast games for 11 bucks. Um, so these are all in really nice shape. I got uh, ECW's Hardcore Revolution. I got WWF Royal Rumble. These are all in really nice shape. And the last one I got was WWF Attitude. So you guys know I really like to collect the, the uh, wrestling games, and I figured you know three Dreamcast ones for eleven bucks, buy two get one. It's a pretty good deal. Um, but that's about it, guys. Um, definitely uh, remember to check out my uh, average uh, gamer show podcast that's on iTunes and um, you can definitely uh, see uh, I'll write it in the links below um, I'm just gonna put iTunes.com because you can go get it from there um, but it is free and it's with me Don Don Raiden and Helsinki Rocks AGF and another guy named uh, Jordan with skating and gaming on YouTube and we have a guest every week, and it's just a fun time to hang out and talk about video games. So definitely uh, check out our podcast. Um, remember to check me out on Justin.TV whenever I'm live streaming. Hopefully I'll be doing one this week. Uh, remember to just check out you know my other videos if you haven't uh, if you missed some. And uh, my website's uh, still in progress. It's coming up soon. So definitely stay tuned, guys. This has been Blake with Blake's Game Room. Peace out, YouTube.